Hi, YouTube. Uh, yes, it's me, Shannon. I know for those of you that know me, it's been a long time. Uh, way overdue videos, I'm sure. Uh, that's what I feel anyway. I mean, I'm, forgive me for that. I'm just lazy. And I'm inspired to do videos, but I just <laughs> kind of just blow it off. <laughs> and I get a lot of comments and a lot of um, uh, input from you guys so saying, hey, what happened? Where you been? Where are you? Are you okay? Can you make some videos? Um, so thank you for that. Um, I mean, along with that is the numbers. Um, right now I have 600 plus friends and subscribers. Thank you all. That's, that's amazing to me. I mean, it's, it's um, a little, the little bit of videos that I do produce, and I'm um, still continuing to produce this network of, of friends and subscribers. I think it's amazing. So I'm glad you enjoy my videos. And it just tells me that maybe I should talk more. So in this video, I want to talk about some of this like relationship and correspondence with YouTube and the people on YouTube, and those in basically interested in these kinds of videos, the, the transsexuals and the transgenders, the queers, if you want to call us that, whatever. I'm not queer, but you can call me one. <laughs> um, maybe I am. But anyhow. That's all beside the point. Um, many times over the last couple of years that I've uh, been on YouTube, um, I received tags now and then, and I didn't know what they were. My ignorance. <laughs> I am so ignorant when it comes to computer things, um, and I learned slowly, as many of us do, uh, about it the more I'm around it. So. Anyway, I had received on many occasions tags from some of you and just people out there tagging me. And I didn't know what it was. And so I was very, very apprehensive and very, very protective, of course, of my identity and, and different things because I'm trans and, and other issues, private issues as well. So I never responded to a tag. So if you're one of those that has tagged me before and said, oh, that bitch, she doesn't respond to tags, you know, fuck her, <laughs> go ahead and tag me again. And I think it would, um, now I think I would really enjoy doing it and um, responding to whatever your questions are and see how well I could respond to those and see if it's like helpful or useful to anybody out there. Um, Anyway, so now that I'm just kind of like up on what it is, and, and I think I don't really know how it works, so I would need to try it. <laughs> so if you want, if you've tagged me in the past, tag me again, and this time I promise to respond. <laughs> if that, if you care. <laughs> Anyhow, um, I miss you guys. I miss making videos. I really, really do. I have so many things to talk about, I don't know which one to pick. <laughs> but... So I'm just kind of all over the place, if you wonder what the hell the video is about. It's just about all kinds of shit, okay? <laughs> I'm doing okay. Uh, struggling right now, as I have been for the last few years, but um, this time of year I'm out of work. Uh, I have part-time work every once in a while, but I'm not generating any income. So I can't make my rent, I can't pay my bills. I'm hungry. I'm on fucking sea rations in my in my cupboards and my in my refrigerator. It's horrible. But uh, I can't find work. Um, there's just everybody's looking for work, and then when you're a tranny on top of it, it, makes it all that much more complicated and challenging to get employed. So I am employed. It's just I won't be returning full time until August. So I've got to get through uh, <clears throat> the rest of, well, it's the end of June now. I've got to get through July and part of August before I start generating some income, which sucks. And it also always, you know, um, I'm a government employee, employee a state employee, and um, uh, very limited income. 
and you know with the changes and, and transition how costly it can be and my my um, goals in my transition it's so hard to reach them from because I'm so limited financially uh, I've lost everything that I ever did have potentially I had a nice home and all those wonderful kinds of things something I worked hard at and built but it all went in the shithole <laughs> Uh, along with my life, but my life has taken on a new chapter in the last few years, and, and a welcomed one for me. I can finally be and live who it is that I am. Um, it's, so it's a little bit different from that perspective, but from a monetary ex um, perspective, it sucks. Okay, I want a sex change, and I can't get it. You know, I'm so happy for all those girls that I watch all the time. The Lady Vixens and the Samanthas and the, and what's your name, Erin, and just a lot of them, on and on and on. All you girls getting your breasts and your pussies and, you know, your sex changes, you lucky bitches. <laughs> but, you know, I don't know if it's, some of it's luck and some of it's just not, you know, it's, it's meant to be. And I hope that my surgery is meant to be that happens for me someday. Um, yeah, I'd like to do lots of things. And time isn't waiting for me. I'm old. I'm getting older by the moment. So I want to enjoy time. Well, I am enjoying. But I want to really live my life now and be able to, like, put into it like any other girl. Could. And I'm so limited because my anatomy and I know I get a lot of argument on that, that, oh, you don't need a pussy to be happy. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. You don't need a pussy to be happy. I do. Okay, so I'm happy, but I mean, I'll be happy there. Wait. That's my choices. Those are my decisions. And I don't really consider a choice. But um, if I can't get it, I can't get it. And that's all a financial burden. It's not... Not because I wouldn't do it. <laughs> Lady Vixen put out a video recently. Would you transition if somebody offered you a free sex change? Shit. And, and you know, what goes into that and how do you really feel about it when it does happen? Shit. I would not have a problem whatsoever <laughs> doing that. Uh, I wouldn't question it, I don't think, for one second. I would jump, well, I would question where the resource came from and what their motivation was to, to support me this way, but as far as my decisions to, to um, change my anatomy, no, it wouldn't even be a question whatsoever. Um, so anyway, gosh, I'm really getting off topic. I don't think there is a topic here. I'm making this video because I'm going to make some more videos and try to have a topic. But this one's just saying, hey, thank you subscribers and friends and all you YouTube viewers that subscribe and, and, and um, invite me. I have all these 600 plus people and it's like, wow, you know, and I haven't even been producing videos. So I'll try to be a little more diligent about that. And like I said, that's where the tags come in too. If you tag me and you want, want me to talk about some shit, hit me up with that. I'll talk about it. <laughs> Relationships, um, transition issues, uh, personal issues to some degree. <laughs> There's some personal things perhaps I wouldn't want to put out there. And just what it's like in my life. And just whatever you want to know. Uh, and I'll do what I can to answer that for you, if you care. So anyway, um, what else do I want to talk about in this video? Maybe that's it. I don't want to make it too long. I better get on to a, a subject. So, hey, see me, feel me, touch me. <laughs> I'll be back. Bye.